way you two are going. Well, on the good side, the temperature has come down out of the stratosphere a little bit. And we've got some slightly cooler weather. It's been like in the low 80s today, which is actually something of a serious break, although I still consider that to be way too hot. Uh, helping that out a bit is a lot of overcast and some scattered thunderstorms and rain and stuff like that. So, not bad. Not bad. Could be better, but not too awfully bad. On the not so great side, it started last night. Just as a small twinge right here and here in the front and back areas of the upper left jaw. It's been growing. It's been getting bigger. It's been getting harder and harder to ignore. And the way this kind of thing works is what this, what's going to happen, and as a matter of fact, it is in the process of happening. The pain starts here in the jaw, and slowly but surely it works its way up the side of my head. And when it gets to about here, it drills its way in where it could just be a really bad headache or it could turn into a full-blown let me hide in the dark for a week migraine. I don't know yet which way it's going but I will say that it's already getting more and more difficult to face any serious amount of light and that's not a good sign. As to how it's going to actually turn out I'm not going to know that until it happens. <laughs> Yeah, and what's really nasty about it, I ran out of painkiller, and I haven't had the opportunity to get any more. Actually, that's not true. I did have the opportunity to get more. I just didn't think of it when I was in the store. And uh, at this point, it's just not going to happen today, if only because I've been out running around every day for the last three. Yesterday, the day before, and the day before that. I am not leaving the house today. I'm going to hope that hot coffee and the caffeine will be sufficient because it's going to have to be. Besides, another reason to not go buying anything right now is I just paid my rent and I paid my bills and if I've got my numbers right, I've got about 20 bucks left for the rest of the month. But I'm not going to know for certain I have the numbers right until things start to clear the bank. Which means I need to wait about three or four days for all these things to clear and make sure that uh, I've got the numbers right. Because I, I can't afford to make any kind of mistake. That little, uh, that not so little bullcrappery event a couple, about a month and a half or whatever ago where uh, I was paying the phone company and I was trying to pay them 50 bucks and they took the full 200 and uh, sent me $150 over that killed it right there I no longer have overdraft protection yeah so that's going to be fun I might be able to get it back but uh, it's better not to need it but then again, I'd rather have it and not need it than to need it and not have it. In any event, I think I'm going to get this finished up and go turn off a couple of more lights. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. Bye bye.